Hey guys, this is Lainey K-Pop here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be adding a new binder to my collection, sorting in some new inclusions, some new photo cards, stickers, etc. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so as usual, we will start out with twice. We have Geo here, and we have about seven photo cards today, so not too many, but enough to sort of Drink down on the collection there. So let's take a look here. We have What is Love card, a Summer Nights card, and we have some more and more and Feel Special. Okay. This is where What is Love starts. This is the tenth one, which goes in that top left hand corner there. There we go. Okay, so there's what is love. And we have summer nights. This one is also I believe it's number 10 in the series that I have, template I have here. So let's put this right before the message card. or yes right now fancy okay here's feel special so we'll put this card down here looking good looking good And now on to more and more. So I think this one comes first. The white border. That one up here. And then we have the Sort of like braid one that she has. I think that one is number six, as far as I remember. Okay, and now on to the duo cards. Geo and Diane. We have all Bloom Duo cards, so cute. At least the ones that I'm collecting. <laughs> all right, and then we have this group card here. As far as I remember, there's a few trio cards that come next, and then the two groups. So we'll put this up here. good now we can move on to oh my girl okay so now we'll go on to oh my girl and I collect Aaron so I have a few group cards here one Aaron card a signed Aaron banana allergy monkey postcard one of you as solo postcards and that's about it so let's take a look here and see where a good spot would be Okay, so 
first up, oh, I almost forgot about this one. This is one of the Japanese group buying cards. Almost we'll skipped that. Don't want to do that. Okay, I think comes before coloring book, if I remember correctly. So I guess I'll put this one in this corner. Garden and remember me. Let's see the, I guess the pink. Yep, <laughs> the pink back. So pretty. All right, so we'll put this one in the top corner. Nice. This whole page is full. All right, <laughs> moving on. So next we have final Erin bungee card that I needed. This is her selfie. And we'll put this one right here. Then we have the group, I believe it's called the summer, group summer card. So we'll stick this one, we'll stick this one up here. Or, yeah, let's do it down here. Sorry, I can't commit to anything. <laughs> Alright, so those are the photo cards. Now we have some bigger inclusions. So we need to add either like a two pocket or maybe a four pocket. We can take a look here. Let's see. So I think maybe a three pocket would work. You can put one on the top and one on the side and leave space for whatever comes next, I guess. So let's do that. Openings up here. Alright, so let's do the solo postcard first. <laughs> I don't know if you've listened to you as solo debut yet, but it was pretty good. I I appreciated it a lot. And I think this photo card, not photo card, this postcard is my favorite of the whole series. So I don't collect Yewa, so I'll just take uh, like one po one postcard and then my two favorite photo cards, which I'm in the process of trading for. But this one was my favorite postcard and I ended up pulling this. So I'll stick that one up there. And then I found this online on Instagram. It says signed, well, my girl Banhana, Japanese. I don't know if it's like a sticker or it's just like a postcard kind of thing, but I was really like excited when I saw this online. I was like, I gotta get that. So let's put it, should we put it like that or like that? Let's put it like this. There's Oh My Girl, and we'll move on to Cherry Bullet next. Alright, so next up we have Cherry Bullet in a collect hand, and I decided to collect her non-album cards as well. So we have one album card here from Love Adventure with the AR card, uh, some broadcast cards from Q&A era, as well as some Let's Play and Q&A inclusions up here. 
a love adventure broadcast postcard type thing and uh, we have hands up right here broadcast cards because there are no album cards for hands up since it was a digital single and even more since we have this whole virus situation going on we didn't get any broadcast cards or album cards for Hello Hot Boy. So sad. Let's go ahead and get started. So we have this pink back from Love Adventure. This is an album card. <laughs> there are a grand total of four album cards. I still have the pink Let's Play card on the way, but we have this one now. So you can stick that in here. Okay. And then, this is going to be tough, because I'm not 100% sure what to do with this. <laughs> this is like the clear AR card kind of thing. You place it over different pictures in the album or photo cards. I don't know if it's the photo cards or just the album, but apparently it has some AR capabilities, which is cool. But I'm not sure if it will fit in a nine pocket. Okay, so it just barely fits. Um, should I put it with a grip card? No, because it kind of makes it kind of murky. I guess I'll just, since it's kind of big, I'll just stick it with the other inclusions. But let's do these broadcast cards. So let's do red first, following our pattern here. And pink next. And we'll put hands up right next to that. Oh, I forgot to show you the back of this one. Okay, so we're good to go on that, but now we need to find a space for these bigger inclusions slash broadcast cards. I think I can probably fit this one in one of those currency style ones. Maybe the other ones might have to do probably two pockets for the inclusions. And maybe I could fit this broadcast card into like a four pocket or a three pocket. Let's take a look. Okay, so let's start with the currency three pocket for the hands up broadcast card. I'm pretty sure that will be the best for that. Oh, I forgot this is different from the other binder I have. If you're wondering, if you're wondering why didn't I get just a bigger binder? Because this one is not pretty big. I have this one already. Reduce, reuse, recycle. So this is from my high school days. Fun, fun. Okay. I think I might end up putting like a white piece of paper or something like that in there. We'll see how lazy I'm feeling at the end of this. And then for the inclusions, let's do a two pocket. <laughs> do you want to see? <laughs> There's nothing on the back. And then this is like a folded sort of like a mini poster in a way but it's like a character profile it's too big to fit into like a magazine size I'm just gonna leave it folded up like that would it fit upright nah let's put it down like that okay and then 
broadcast card. And I guess we'll just stick the AR part in here while we're waiting to get some more cherry bullet cards. I should probably put this the other way. This fit in that side. It's kind of a tight fit with the plastic. Hmm. Could do it sideways, I guess, but I feel like that kind of takes away from it. I'll just take the plastic off because I'm lazy. See how it fits like that. Okay, yeah, that fits nice. And then we'll just put the AR card down there. She can chill for now. Gotten and alone. All right, that's Cherry Bullet. We'll leave that the way it is for now. Let's move on to Yukika because I got Yukika's album. I got from the page protectors for all the inclusions and stickers. So do that next. All right, so we have some Yukika Soul Lady inclusions slash stickers slash ID. I don't know if you consider this a photo card or not because it's super small. But uh, I think we're going to put the stickers and the ID in a night pocket. So I have one of those already put in here. Let's start with the ID. There's nothing on the back. Since it's so small, I just put it in one of these uh, matte white uh, card sleeves. I don't know what you call them. Uh, let's put this one up here. Since this looks like it's from Neon. And then we have some of our stickers here. We have five right now, so we'll start like this. A day for love. So put that one up here. I think this one is Jerry's Jubilee. Think. My Korean's really bad. And then we have yesterday. This one fits this snugly in one of the clear sort of like inner sleeve type things. It won't fit in one of these matte ones, so I figured I'd just put it in front like that. So it looks similar to the other ones, but still protected. So we'll put this one down here. Alright, so that's good. Now let's do, let's do the postcards next. Postcards, I think we can fit in a three pocket. And we have three postcards for now, so that works. Stick this in here. Okay. So this works because we have two in portrait and one in landscape. So that works very nicely. This one right here. Put this one on the top. We have this star dress one. And this one as well. sure about this little ticket thingy. I think it might be too tall. Let's see if this will fit. 
in this. We might end up using, if I can get it in. The passport fits in there perfectly. We'll do a currency for the ticket. we have what they call the bookcase. I don't really understand why it's called that. If you do, please leave me a comment so I can answer all these unanswerable questions in my mind. <laughs> this one is definitely going to need a magazine. So I have a magazine page protector right here. stick this right in the tippity top. Perfect. So there's all of Yukika. Next we have G-Friend. Okay, so next up we have G-Friend. I collect Yuji inclusions. I don't really collect the photo cards too much just because there's so many and I'm so far behind. I can only do that with twice. <laughs> so I just collect ones that I happen to pull, and then you do inclusions for everything else. So we'll get started with the photo card like things slash inclusions. So we'll start with this one from LOL since chronologically it's the earliest one that I have. And let's just put this on the top. I'm not so particular about how these are. And then next we'll do, let's do this one from Time for the Moonlight. It's like the little bookmark type thingy. Put that one in the top. That little ribbon's gonna stick out and that's gonna bug me. Let's see. Maybe I should put it at the bottom, perhaps? Yeah, so then it's at least somewhat protected. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. And we'll do the sunrise ones next. These are clear photo card type things. I put them in these white white um, card protector things. That works out pretty well. Then we have some like group or duo, I guess, duo cards with uh, Anji from Song of the Sirens, Apple. I guess it's called whatever that symbol is. Is that supposed to be Labyrinth or something? I know that's what the first, well, not the first one before this one was called, it was called Labyrinth, but Song of the Sirens, so. We'll do this like this, one on each side, and then the lenticular from Song of the Sirens in the middle. it for the photo card like things we have these like folding papers but I think they're gonna be too big yeah they're gonna be too big for the night pocket so we'll have to put them I 
guess we'll have to put him in a four pocket. We'll do that. I think I'm going to do those sort of towards the end though because they seem a little bit heavier. Let's do these little doodad thingies first. We'll do the currency pocket for this film strip. At least if it will fit. Of course not. Nothing is simple, naturally. Let's grab that. I guess we'll have to put it in a single magazine. Maybe we could stick it in with one of these other ones. So we'll do it like this. That'll have to work. And since this one is so big, this mobile from Sunrise slash Time for Us era. Which song? Which song? Which side do you prefer? Should we do this side? Or the one with the string? Probably this one, right? I don't know. You're going to be like, no, we should do it with the string. Shoulda, coulda, woulda. struggling here today. Okay, that works, I guess. Just have to be gentle. <laughs> and we'll leave that one towards one of the ends. Let's see about these ones now. So maybe a three or a four. Let's try the four first. It's gonna be too big. It's gonna be too big. Yep. <laughs> we'll try something else. Feel bad for the four four pockets. They never get utilized like they should. Let's try a three. That's gonna fall out, but I don't really have much choice. Let's see about this coaster. It goes like that, I think. That works. There's this pop out card, you do. I don't really feel like taking it out. I will. Where's the opening? Ah, here we go. don't think this is going to fit. We'll give it a try. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Hang in there. Breathe. 
got through it. It's not going to fit with this plastic. Goodbye, plastic. We'll use it for something else. Okie dokie. Of course. So now, let's do some of these uh, bigger things. I wonder if I can fit these stickers in a two pocket or what are they going to need? These stickers from Fever Season. Going on the back, so I'll put them back to back. Which work. Do you see this? Do you see this problem? Ultra Pro needs to make some bigger two pockets because I'm tired of using so many. Take two. Maybe this pop up card from Labyrinth will fit. Probably not, but let's just give it a try just to say we could. That's like barely. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I guess we're doing one pockets then, folks. Might as well get all the one pockets over here. We're just going to be using them for every single cute friend, including... Alright. Take one. Okay. Should I put this one on the bottom? Since it's pretty flat. And let's do LOL occlusions next. Got the paper doll and Yuji's letter. So we'll just put those back to back. with me here. Okay. Maybe? It's like it's not lining up just right. Oh well. And we have some various other LOL inclusions with nothing on the back of that one. These ones have like postcard style things on the back, but I'm not too concerned about that just because there are three of them. And then one of the sticker sheets, so something's got to give. Let's do these two together. And these two together. There's the next one. This postcard. And this one.
Okie dokie. Let's do... This one. pockets so now let's find something that we can put these folding papers in I think we can do a four pocket I think we can do it four pocket is your time to shine okie dokie so we'll put the Broken mirror one first. I have it sort of like in a little sleeve. I'll open it up for you. There's that one. Put it back in its little sleeve thing. It doesn't fit perfectly, but there's like a little bit of overhang. But as long as I put it down like that, at least it will be somewhat together. So we'll do this one like this. Then we have the tilted version. Wayne's that shoe. Sorry, this is a lot of like unnecessary commentary. It's been a long day. Okie dokie. Then we have the Apple version. Okay. And let's stick this one down here. Alright, so we're good to go on that. That one fever season card is trying to come out. Let's do a quick flip through of this binder and then we'll go back to the twice and oh my girl binder too.
right, so that closes out my video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any comments or suggestions or anything like that, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. You can always check out my Instagram if you're interested. My Instagram is Lainey Kpop. My trading account is Lainey Kpop Trade. So if you wanted to trade or buy from me uh, or with me, feel free to do so. Uh, let me know how many groups you collect, what exactly it is you collect for each one. As you can see, it's sort of like a random system, but it makes sense to me. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye!